I want to show off a really neat technique in regards to utilizing Microsoft Excel VBA. Typically when we think of recording macros or writing our own VBA code within Excel, we think of opening up the VBA window, which I'll do right here. Let me go ahead and get that started. I'm going to use the shortcut key of Alt F11. This will open up my VBA window. And we think, well, I need some place to store the code. So I go up to my insert menu and I insert what's called a module. So a module, all it really is, is just a container for us to store code within, to modulize our code, kind of separate one block of code with other blocks of code and so on. Well, this is one place to be able to store code. What I want to show off here is how we have the ability within Microsoft Excel to automate some procedure on an event, and specifically an event of when the workbook is opened. So as soon as the Microsoft Excel document workbook opens, I want a procedure that runs, okay? Whatever it does, but it runs as soon as that workbook is open. Well, I'm not gonna put this inside of a standard module, although we could have some code inside of a module that gets called to from the event, but that's another story. Here, just taking a look at the event itself. Got the VBA window open. I've got the project panel open, and I'm gonna give the this workbook object a double click. Just double click that object. So this is gonna open up very similar to what looks like a module. I've just got a, what looks like a blank sheet of paper in front of me that I can start putting code inside of. But the code that we placed into here is being associated with this workbook. So now, if I hop up to the top, I got two little menus, one called general, one called declarations. If I hop into general, there's an option for general and workbook. I'm gonna go ahead and change that to workbook. And right away, I get a little stub of a procedure based on the open event of the workbook object. Okay. I can see up here inside the uh, top right corner, it now says open. And if I go into the drop down there, you're gonna find several different types of events associated with the workbook object. Now, any code that I put in here will run as soon as the workbook is open. So let me try something simple here. I'm just gonna do a little message box. And I'll have, it, have a message in here. We'll say, uh, workbook has been opened. That's pretty simple, right? Message box, workbook has been opened. All right, and that's it. Now remember, this is happening within the workbook open event. So let me close the uh, VBA window. I'm gonna go ahead and close this workbook. And you know what, I need to go ahead and save it. Um, but I need to save it as in macro enabled workbook because it now contains code within it. So let me go ahead and save that. All right, there we go. So now let me go ahead and close that file. Closed. I'm gonna go ahead and reopen it. So I'll go to my open. I'm gonna open up the file that I just saved, sample task 01 XLSM is the macro enabled workbook. All right, now look at this. Because of the security settings that I have on my macros within my copy of Excel, it's telling me that they've been disabled. But I'm gonna go ahead and enable the content, and there's my little pop-up. I didn't have to press any additional buttons, I didn't have to run any shortcut keys, no menu commands. As soon as the workbook is opened, it runs that procedure, and in this case, spits out the little message box, workbook has been opened. So it's that simple, you wanna automate a task, as soon as a workbook is opened, you've got an event for it. Workbook open. Try it out, get a little experience with it. You can just open up a brand new document, open up the VBA window, go to the workbook, and look for the open event.